In this video we are going to see Honeywell H78 DB series temperature and humidity duct sensor overview, wiring data, dimensions, installation guidelines, technical data, connect sensor to PLC and pros and cons. If you are watching our videos first time please subscribe to our YouTube channel this will help us to make more videos, and don't forget to click the bell icon button you will never miss our latest videos. Welcome to Controls and Systems YouTube channel. H78 DB series duct mounting humidity and temperature sensors are designed for environmental monitoring and control applications in industrial, commercial and general building. These sensors can be used for discharge, or return air control, sensor materials, sensor specification manual, screws, gasket, flange, cover, plug base, filter, storage, temperature, minus 40 degrees Celsius to plus 70 degrees Celsius, housing material is plastic, PC ABS, flame retardant tack. With UL94 V0, protection standard is IP54, protection standard, EN61061, dimension, height 340 mm, depth 40 mm, Sensor cover dimension, height with cable gland is 120 mm, height without cable gland is 90 mm, width 70 mm, sensor probe is 14 diameter. Wiring of type 1.0 square millimeters at WG18, for PT1000 is 0.11 K when NTC is negligible, wiring of type 0.5 square millimeters. Technical specification, relative humidity, measurement range is 0 to 100% RH, output is 20 milliamps or 0 to 10 volt DC, accuracy, 2%, 3%, 5% RH, 25 degrees Celsius, 20 to 80% RH, 5%, 9% RH, 25 degrees Celsius. 0 to 20% and 80 to 100%, long term stability, RH per year. This picture R mentioned the different model ranges with OS number, humidity output, humidity accuracy, temperature output type, temperature range are available in Honeywell H78 DB series duct sensors, temperature, temperature sensor type is NTC 10K, NTC 20K, PT 1000, Measurement range is 0 to 50, resistance output, minus 10 to 40 or 0 to 70, transducer, output is 4 to 20 milliamps or 0 to 10 volt DC, NTC 10K, NTC 20K, PT 1000, accuracy, A plus minus 0.2K at 25 degrees Celsius for NTC 10K sensor, electrical data, Power supply is 24 volt AC A plus minus 15% or 24 volt DC A plus minus 10%. Current output load is 500 ohms maximum. Voltage output load is 10 kilo ohms minimum. Current consumption in DC is 70 milliamps maximum. Current consumption in AC is 190 milliamps maximum. Working temperature is minus 30 degrees Celsius to plus 70 degrees Celsius. Attention! Absolutely avoid extreme mechanical and unspecified strain. When using a 24 volt AC transformer, use an isolated transformer, class 2. If sharing the transformer with your controller, valve, actuator, or any other device, be sure to connect all of the devices with the proper polarity, since most controllers are earth grounded. Failure to do so may result in damage to the transducer, your controller, or any other devices that are attached due to a ground loop problem. Connector terminals, 24V terminal means power supply for sensor either 24 volt AC or 24 volt DC, V terminal means power supply 0 volt AC or DC. RH terminal means relative humidity either 0 to 10 volt or 4 to 20 milliamps. T terminal means temperature either 0 to 10 volt or 4 to 20 milliamps. 
GND terminal means ground for both humidity and temperature terminals, last two terminal is load resistance. Wiring. For temperature output you can wiring like this diagram for both this two model sensor. For temperature sensor and humidity output you can wiring like this diagram for this all model sensors. For temperature and humidity output you can wiring like this diagram for this all model sensors. Output is voltage mode, 0 to 10 volt, when load resistance is over 10 kilo ohm. 2. Output is current mode, 4 to 20 milliamperes, when load resistance is less than 500 ohm. 500 ohm is recommended. 3. Power on again after load resistor switch. 4. Field wiring AWG 18 to 24 connects to a terminal block on the PCB. 5. Maximum length 200 meters, current output recommended. 6. Offset for temperature sensor due to wire resistance per 10 meters distance from sensor to controller. Installation guidelines. Drilling a mounting hole on the duct near measuring point. Using closed screws to install the flange with gasket on the duct. Insert the probe pipe into flange and duct. Fix the probe pipe on the flange by enclosed screw. Note. Plug face to the bottom direction, lead wire from DDC or PLC panel through plug, using screwdriver to connect each wire to the terminals of the transducer module according to field wiring diagram, tighten the waterproof plug around the wires, put front cover back and tighten f
called the sensor knob the RH and temperature value will increase gradually, then I release my hand and sensor value will come to normal condition depending on the environmental condition. The product is equipped with stainless steel filter. Since the sensor is an ESD sensitive device, you should avoid touching the sensor cap during operation. For maintenance purposes it is recommended that you observe the valid DSD safety precautions. Please don't use in corrosive environment. Pros. Advantages. It is used for 4 to 20 milliampers or 0 to 10 volt DC or resistance output for temperature. It is used for 4 to 20 milliampers or 0 to 10 volt DC output for humidity. Duct mounted. Excellent linearity. Good long term stability. High reliability. Wide sensing range. Easy installation. Good accuracy. Cons. Disadvantage. Sensor wiring connector terminal is too small. Wiring connection is too complicated. Will we hope this video is useful to you. Thank you for watching our videos. We will meet in a another good video. Have a great day.